335 in the divisional rounds, we have the six-seeded Rams traveling to Lambeau Field against the Green Bay Packers. Now, I don't know exactly who is going to start in this game. It, Sean McVay has kind of been wishy-washy all week long, whether Jared Goff would start, whether John Wolford would be healthy, or maybe we would see a little bit of Blake Blortles, the legend himself, the GOAT, if you can believe it, Blake the man, the myth, the legend, Blordles. Now, I know what you might be thinking. Do the Rams hold a chance against the Packers? And they do if they do these things. Number one, keep the ground game chugging, right? Green Bay Packers have proven against the Titans that they know how to stop the run. But against Chicago or more uh, David Montgomery-like backs instead of Derrick Henry, they struggled, right? David Montgomery really ran over the Packers. So the real question is, what is the difference between Derrick Henry and David Montgomery? Well, the honestly, I don't know the answer. Just on paper, it seemed like Derrick Henry would do better, right? But the fact is they were able to stop him rather easily while David Montgomery, uh, I don't know. He just didn't do as well. Here's what my theory is. The Green Bay Packers were, in fact, traveling to Chicago, right? Uh, the Lambeau field really kind of helps, if it's, especially if it's snowy. It's harder for receivers to run routes, especially when they're not prepared. Thank you, Tennessee Titans receivers, for not getting the right cleats on. Uh, but in Chicago, it's not. It wasn't snowing that day, right? So I think the snow matters a lot. If it's snowing, I really doubt the Rams can win this game. But if it's not, I think the Rams have a shot. Here's why. Uh, here, The reason why the Packers were able to dominate against the Tennessee Titans, if you were actually watching that game, is receivers ran their routes. It was hard for them to run their routes. They didn't have a lot of enough spikes to get into the snow, right? So they couldn't cut their routes crispy like Devontae Adams was doing against the Tennessee defenders, right? On the other hand, when they went to Chicago, there was no snow. So the receivers were able to cut more freely, which makes you worried about the casting game, which means you can't load up the box, which is what they were doing against Derrick Henry and why David Montgomery had a good day and Derrick Henry did not. So the real question is, can the Rams do that? Can they? Uh, will it not snow? I honestly don't know the forecast. I don't think it's going to snow, but I could be wrong. Now, if the Rams really want to get this going. they got to make sure that Cam Akers gets to the outside and to the inside as well. And you got to utilize the play action game. That's how you have to win. And can't turn the ball over. Defense can only do so much. Can't expect them to do that much. Right? So, that's the keys to winning. So, if the Rams, the Rams' obvious weakness is not their defense. It's not their run game. It's the quarterback play, right? Can their quarterback be, you know, uh, steady? Can it be steady at it? Because that's really all the Rams need. If you look at that defense, you look at that run game, you look at their receiving talent, they have enough to possibly win the Super Bowl. If you look at it, but can Jared Goff be that steady at it? Can he make sure to be kind of like the point guard of the football field? We don't need you taking super deep shot, but you need you to get it to Robert Woods, get it to Cooper Cup, did it, get it to Tyler Higbee, you know, get it to Gerald Everett, and especially Cam Akers out of the backfield. So it's going to be interesting. That's what the Packers Rams have to do. That's their biggest weakness, is the quarterback. Biggest weakness for the Packers, at least in my opinion, has been that passing defense. It's a little bit, except for Jenny or Alexander, it's been a little bit, eh, to start out the season. Can Jared Goff uh, take advantage of that? I think on top of that, they have not been the best at pa rushing the passer lately. So can Jared Goff, you know, can Andrew Whitworth and those other offensive linemen for the Rams buy him some fine? So that's going to be the real question. Honestly, I don't think the Rams are going to be able to do it, unfortunately, for me as a Saints fan. Uh, but I, I really hope they do. I mean, like, this is not a, an attack against you, Rams fans. Like, I would honestly love for you guys to come to Superdome. It would be amazing. Uh, especially we could get a revenge game. Uh, I love revenge games. I like to get revenge on you guys for the no call. But I honestly think the Packers are going to win this one. I do think the Rams are going to cover, though.